Hi, I'm Lou, another episode of My Car Story. I'm here with Mir. Mir, what's your last name? Imav. Say that again. Mir Imav. And what do you, who do you work for? Uh, Lamborghini Gold Coast Prolo Chicago. And you've been working there for about six years. Six years, yeah. So you, you've had a few fun cars that you've been able to drive. Yeah. <laughs> Today you drove one out to Rise and Drive in Chicago. So with that being said, uh, let's take a look at what you brought today. I'll grab the camera as I usually do. Mir, stand right next to me. First of all, thanks for showing us your super cool car. And what did you bring out here today? So I bought a, uh, a Lamborghini Aventador Roadster. And uh, this one is uh, Bianco Ice, which is a pure white color. Um, it's dressed with a uh, nice two-tone interior called the Sportivo package. Uh, it's got the nice Dioni wheels, uh, carbon fiber package on the outside. Great example of uh, the V12 coming from Italy. So come on over. Now the Roadster, what's the difference between the Roadster and the non-Roadster? Is that uh, the top just, or? Yeah, just pretty, much, side with you? just pretty much the uh, pretty much the top on there, so. Okay. Yeah. And uh, so this one is actually a hard top. Okay. So, um, you know, it has two removable carbon fiber hard, hard tops on there too, so. And it, it has. stored right in the front. It is stored in the front. You can take a look at those beautiful headlights. Everything is spectacularly done here. We've got carbon fiber there. Now the 50th, this is representing the 50th anniversary. Yeah, in 2014, uh, it was a big year for Lamborghini. It was the 50 years of the uh, company. So pretty much all the production cars from 2014 you know, had the uh, 50th badge on them too. So. And uh, when, you're, uh, when you're driving this up here in Chicago, I mean, uh, what type of reaction do you have when this happens? It's a, it's a head turner, you know. <laughs> it's like uh, imagine uh, a fighter jet on the road, you know. That's this is essentially that's what this is. That's absolutely fabulous. I'm getting all the venting on it, and uh, the Aventador is is the top of the line. Yeah. So Lamborghini makes uh, two vehicles: the V10, the Huracan, um, and the Aventador, which is the V12. And this is the big boy. This is the big boy. The best of the best. Look at the beautiful yep. artwork. They, uh, when they designed this uh, back end of the car, they all, almost had wanted to have a uh, kind of like a physiological effect, like a spine of an animal or something. Yeah. That's the kind of effect it has with the transparent bonnet, the way it's set up. And uh, I love the fact that we've got more than enough room to walk around it and see it and get the experience. Because you know, the problem is people go on the website and they don't really feel it. But yet, if you go to a video and you get the chance to really enjoy all the pieces and the details, which is what we're featuring right now, and check out the size of the wheels on the ground there as we pan back, it just feels hey, great. Let's uh, pop one of the doors. All of the, the, the angles on the car. So when you pop the door, it does that or as I like to show. Like that. Now we'll take a look at the interior, but before we do that, let's look at the engine. So this is, it's, this is probably one of the only cars in uh, production right now that has a Formula, Formula One pushrod, like the, uh, the, the way the suspension is mm -hmm. set up on this car. Go ahead, tell me about it. So, so um, what else do we need to know from the, uh, I mean, who is really driving these on the track? I mean, you have a certain buyer who takes these and just enjoys the track with them, or is it, are they mostly garage kept? You know, mostly collectors I, I would garage? have to say, like, more, like, around in the Midwest, yeah. guys will probably enjoy it on the weekends and stuff like that. Yeah. It's kind of interesting that you mentioned the track aspect, because Lamborghini is a... Coming out with the new Super Veloce, which is the SV edition of the Aventador. Okay. Um, so we should actually have that coming up in the next month at our uh, location. Well, that'll uh, be a wonderful. Yeah. So that's gonna be technically this car um, in a track edition. Got it. So people will be yeah. able to come on out. Let me take a look at the interior. Then uh, you can see just as you come to the door, the Aventador. And let's take a look at the interior. All of the geometric shapes. Amir, why don't we do this? Look at the beautiful mounting. Why don't you jump in? Could you start it? Because I want to just show yeah, people what, the, what, the, what it's going to look like when you start it because it's yeah. almost a video game in there. I'll give you a little exhaust note too. 
So that would be I'll great. go and turn it on and then uh, we'll get some exhaust note. Yeah. So nobody's behind me. I just want to make sure. No, yeah, you're good. Yeah. So here's the gauges. They all come up. Let me move you around here for a second. Sure. There you go. There's what my mirror's looking at. Yep, so you got the tachometer right over here. And then you can switch that to a speedometer if you wanted to. A lot of the guys prefer the tack so they know exactly where they need to hit the next gear. Yes. Uh, so it's got a seven speed transmission. All of the controls are in the center cockpit over here. Okay. Uh, they're designed to be like right at your fingertips and it's got the push button engine start which is kind of like kind of gives you that effect like you're you know activating the car it's like it's, it's really cool the dynamic uh, driving modes um, Corsa is like the ultimate mode it opens up the exhaust too Sport is kind of like in the city and the Strata mode is like more in the traffic area where you just want to take it easy and just drive the car like maybe in an automatic mode you can you can do that got it alright let me get a so, little exhaust note yeah Sounds wonderfully screaming. Let's have you shut that off and come on out and we'll have you stand right next to your gorgeous oh, car here. Hey, hey, what's oh, more? Fire. What's more? Oh, hey, Carl. Come on, stand right next to it. Come on up, Mir. Stand right next to it. Joe Perillo's Chicago location. Come see him, Mir. Thanks for being on my car story. All right, thank you.